obstacle, danger, and fear. We no longer hunt for our food, search for our water or big fire. We're no longer hungry, thirsty, or cold. We're no longer alive. The solution is war. War will bring out our best. War will bring us life.
Missing head bone. Oh, another left hand. Oh, that's like uh, 27. Uh, statistically speaking, that's a little. Ah! I'm going. Grabbing the machine gun. Freeze the father. I'm going. Holy shit! You're gonna fit in well. New world order is erupting all around us. Know what I'm saying? Okay, call, call, call me Tweak. I'm technically Aaron, but we don't need to be talking about official forms of ID, do we? Do we? No, 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 I didn't think so. You uh, don't look cultish. In fact, you have a distinct anti-cult vibe, which I dig. Hey, you, you know, I've been working on something for, for people like you who are taking on the, 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 the cult. You know, top secret, very hush-hush. I consider myself something of a professional amateur chemist, and I've got uh, recipes that will make you harder, better, faster, and stronger. No, 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 don't, 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 don't think of them like, 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 like drugs, but, but like performance enhancers. You like the sound of that? Thought so. Oh, but small snake, my, my, my supplies are low, so I'm gonna need some more special ingredients. I, I go myself, but uh, uh, kind of busy here. If you're interested, find the goods, then then meet me at Prosperity. Okay, it's a little town southeast of here. Hey, am I am I imagining a conversation we had, or did I not tell you to get the stuff already? We kept our home base thanks to you. Hey, Deputy, can we talk a minute? We got one big job around here, and that's to stop Faith. She took everything from me my job, my marriage, even my son. All because of that bliss. You're one of us now, a cougar. We're a team that helps each other. I need your help right now, Deputy. 
You know about our water treatment plant? You got it. The cult took it and started pumping it full of bliss. You believe that? Right into the drinking water. What kind of monster does that? Well, she's not getting away with it any longer. I tell you straight, we're gonna shut it down fast. What do you say? Howdy, man. County jail is still safe thanks to you. Please don't give it. You're a beacon of hope here, deputy. That was the chance. What the hell was that? I'm no weirdo, but it pays to buy quality when it comes to prepping. You're the one who freed you those folks Jesus. out of the jail. What? Fighting. We're all rooting for you. Word is the marshal's with faith. If we don't find him, he's gonna wind up as an angel. Thanks for the help out of the jail. Good Lord! Hey, sorry about before. Wasn't cool. Ask anyone here. I do tough really good, but the rest, well, I'm working on it. So, restart. Welcome. You'll like the team we got. Everyone's strong, and we need to be with what's beyond those walls. I hope Earl's right about you. We've all been trying to figure out how to crush Eden's gate. You ask me, it starts with faith. At least that's what she's calling herself these days. You seen that giant statue on the hill? Of course you have. You can't miss it. Good old Joseph Seed, the father. Faith had her groupies build that concrete eyesore for her sick pilgrimage. You seen them? Those sad fuckers marching their way to that statue? It's horrible. We gotta tear down that statue. Let all those Peggies know their father ain't no fucking god. He's just a man. What do you say, Rook? Go drive a big fuck you size hole into that thing. That big eyesore is still waiting for you to fuck it up, deputy. Go tear that shit down. You'll have to hang in there and get some pretty heavy weapons. Got a job that needs doing. Last two days, we've had a few people go missing. Only from what we can tell, they weren't lost in the bliss. There's been rumors of some place run by Faith's favorites. The kind of place nobody comes back from. Torture, drownings, sacrifices. 
People say anyone who doesn't walk Faith's little pilgrimage winds up there. I think we got a real problem on our hands, and I need someone to check it out. Someone who can handle themselves if it turns out to be more than just stories. Be careful, Rook. Exactly the Alamo, is it? Gotta stay focused. Calm down. We're out of our league. How are you doing, man?
Those who walk the path do so because it is their choice. Who are you to stop them? These pilgrims seek salvation. Do not interfere with them again. Just when you think things can't get worse. Is there anyone you tip the map, here there's me? been a bunch of cult traffic around the old sulfur mine. Hell, that place is massive. You know they gotta be hiding something good in there. I think it's worth the risk. Is there anyone around here that can help me? You're not gonna believe me? I buy that. There's a crazy-ass bear in Lydia's cave. The cult used that drug to try and turn it into some kind of weaponized super bear. Didn't work. And it got loose. It's nasty as all get out and tough. We sent a bunch of people to kill it, but none of them came back. I'm hoping you got what it takes to get rid of that sucker. Please, before it kills more people. On behalf of all the cougars, thank you. Don't you understand what we're trying to build? Or do you just not care? I watch you run this way and that, inflicting violence on those who wish no harm upon you. They're at peace here. They want to be here. I know you have your doubts. This is the only way the story ends. Nothing you can do can change that. Your friends on the outside, they're controlled by fear. They don't understand. But he does. He'll show you. Hey, Rook. Come on. 
Come on, it's okay. I know you're here to take me back. It's okay. She knows. Everybody knows. You think you're doing the right thing. You think I need to be rescued. But I don't. I don't want to go back. <sighs> Ever. <sighs> have you... Have you ever stopped and looked at how your life's turned out? I mean, what you've actually done with it, you know? Oh, we're told we can be anything, right? Uh, a famous singer, a hall of famer, a movie star. We're all gonna be a success, Rook. But no, that's, not, that's just not true. We live mundane lives, just doing what someone else tells us to do, day after day. <clears throat> Everybody thinks they have free will, but come on, when's the last time we did something that wasn't required, demanded? Nah, Rook, we don't live our lives. We live theirs. And we think we have free will. But that is just a lie. An illusion. Huh? Oh, oh, man. I am so done with that. I am done with being the yes man. I am done with being the errand boy. And I am done with being the garbage collector. I am so done. Because if that is real life, then what is the point? <laughs> this place gave me the chance to become something I thought I could never be. the only thing that really matters happiness don't trust the bliss you need to get the marshal Now's the time. Don't let the marshal get through those gates. Get the marshal now. Rook, you need to save him. Stay away from me. All right. 
Serving papers? No if so, I, <laughs> I'm not in charge. Whoa, wait, you're new. Hey, you want to work in a movie? Of course you do. You are the solution to all my problems. Classic tale. The small town nobody, you, arrives just in time to save world-renowned auteur, Guy Marvel, yours truly. My movie, my masterpiece, is four fucking years in the making, and I will not have it derailed by these fucking plebes with no cinematic vision. You know how many fucking awards Blood Dragon 3 is gonna win if we shoot this fucker correctly? <laughs> All of them! Except this entire stretch of flyover country is a 160 decibel noise factory, and I need absolute fucking silence for this scene! Be the hero, big shot. My first AD will fill you in. I need to contemplate my own genius for a bit. <laughs> Let's do this. Come here, listen. I'm not the first AD. Seriously? Anyways, listen. I'm not the first AD, I'm just the sound guy, Dean. Guy fired the first AD after he refused to use live ammunition on cows. Now his genius idea is to shoot a scene like a silent film, only using sound. So, you could probably figure out how well that's going. Noise? In the wilds of Montana? Go figure. This place is loud as fuck. Your job is to kill the sound. And I mean kill it. You hear that horn? It's shit like that we gotta shut down. Go kill the noise. Whatever it takes. I've got a 16 millimeter black and white, 35 mil color, 8 mil for cinema verite, even a smartphone, and you don't call me for your epic liberation of the county jail? Opportunity missed, my friend. Fuck you very much.
Are you ready for me? That's got it. Okay, come on back. I'm listening for more trouble. We got trouble up top. Sounds like shooting. Get up there quick. talent, kid. Those pussies back in Hollywood can learn a little something from you. The ferocity you showed! Mm, intense, frightening. You made me shoot my pants a little, but, but I liked it. Now I can finally spray my magic all over this film! Mm. Blood Dragon 3 will be a masterpiece! Seriously, it has to be. I can't go back to working on shit like Far Cry. I'd rather put my balls in a vice and listen to everyone with their fucking opinions about world building and player motivation and believability. Oh, I'll kill myself, I swear to fucking God. Oh, and I wasn't kidding before. Close set, get the fuck out of here.
got a job for any volunteers. I need a favor. You say something? It looks like the Peggy's kept a bunch of angels locked in the basement. I don't know how many they got down there, but I ain't going near them. I've seen one too many angels that were once my friends. Listen, we need to secure this whole area. That means the basement, too. You'd be doing me a big favor if you marched down there and cleaned them out. for a taxidermist. Give me a buck of squirrel. What? Oh, I prefer bass fishing myself. Fantastic. There's new stuff added all the time. Thanks for what you did at the jail. Nice day. Too bad it doesn't mean what it used to. My cousin makes knife handles from elk antlers. Solid stuff. Take 
tear these shit in? Thanks for the help. Stay sharp. You got this. Finally shot that bear that was going through the garbage. That's strange.
Oh, you big time. Thank you for saving me. My name is Dr. Charles Lindsay. I'm part of a group hold up south of here at the old jail. Faith and her angels have been trying to get to us for days. I was out here looking for a way to stop them when the cult took me. I think I found a way to bait the angels, but the ingredients for the bait are in my bag and the cult food in the pond. And I... I can't swim. I know, I know who can't swim, but I need you to go get it for me. Part of me wishes I'd stayed up at Carroll College, or even moved to Missoula like Paul was. Not that things hadn't broken down with him, but anyway, I would have escaped all of this. But then, maybe Tracy and Virgil and the others wouldn't have made it. How do you know what the right path is? Sorry, my name's Charles. Everyone calls me Doc, but I'm not... I'm not that kind of doctor. I'm a veterinarian. But right now, I guess I'm the resident ER doctor. <laughs> Stitching up bullet wounds is a lot different than delivering cabs, that's for goddamn sure. Sorry, doesn't matter. Here's the deal. I stumbled on something that seems to attract the angels. Which means we could herd them. I went out to try a field test, but things went sideways. Fucking cult. <sighs> I'm missing ingredients, and if I stay out here, I'm just gonna wind up dead. I have to get back to the prison. Can you help me? I've got the list of stuff I still need. If you could find them, we may actually have a chance at surviving. You've probably seen even worse things than I have out here, huh? We heard about you at the jail. Broadcast over the radio. If you need a refuge, it's the closest thing to it. I've been away too long, really. Trace will be pissed if she has to sew up people by herself again. <laughs> 